In a second term, I'll provide school choice to every parent in America. A vote for Republicans is a vote for safe communities, great jobs, a limitless future for all Americans. It's really a vote for the American dream. That's what it is. It's the American dream versus the American nightmare. Instead of letting Washington change us, despite all that we've been through, we are changing Washington. So, in concluding, this wonderful afternoon, and again, Don, thank you very much. But in concluding this wonderful afternoon, and if the governor comes after you, which he shouldn't be doing, I'll be with you all the way. I'll be with you all the way. Don't worry about it, though. Over the next four years, we'll be making America into the manufacturing superpower of the world, and we'll end our reliance on China once and for all. We will make our medical supplies right here in the United States. We will rapidly return to full employment, soaring economies, and record prosperity. We will expand opportunity zones, and we will continue cutting taxes and regulations at a level that nobody has ever seen before. We will hire more police, increase penalties for assaults on law enforcement, surge federal prosecutors into high-crime communities, and we'll be watching the ballots very closely also, by the way. And we will ban sanctuary cities. We will appoint prosecutors. Judges and justices who believe in enforcing the law, not in enforcing their own agenda. We will ensure equal justice for citizens of every race, color, religion, and creed. We will defend the dignity of work and the sanctity of life. We will uphold religious liberty, free speech, and the right to keep and bear arms. We will strike down terrorists who threaten our citizens, and we will keep America out of these endless, ridiculous foreign wars. All coming back. We will maintain America's unrivaled military might, and we will ensure peace through strength. Two and a half trillion dollars. Have the strongest military we've ever had. Beautiful, brand new equipment. When I took it over, it was totally depleted, our military. We have the greatest equipment that any military has ever even conceived of. Things that people have no idea what we have, and let's keep it that way. We will end surprise medical billing, require price transparency already signed, further reduce health insurance premiums, and the cost of prescription drugs will be dropping like a rock very soon. The drug companies do not like me too much. It's a favorite nation's laws I signed. We will strongly protect Medicare, and your Social Security will be totally secure, and we will always protect patients with pre-existing conditions. America will land the first woman on the moon, and the United States will be the first nation to land an astronaut on Mars. When I took over, NASA was a shell of itself. It was closed. It was — they had grass growing in the runways. Grass growing in the runways. Now it's the number one space center in the world by far. We will stop the radical indoctrination of our students and restore patriotic education to our schools. We will teach our children to love our country, honor our history, and always respect our great American flag. We will live by the timeless words of our national motto, In God We Trust, and we're going to keep it that way. For years, you had a president who apologized for America. Now you have a president who is standing up for America and standing up
for your state, Nevada.